In 2019, it was reported that Real Housewives of New York star Ramona Singer had sold her longtime Upper East Side abode for $4 million. While the place had become too big for her, she moved into a new apartment only 20 blocks away, and then last year moved from that apartment on the 31st floor up to an even nicer one a few floors up. Finding it hard to keep up with her luxury homes yet? Ramona also owns a stunning mansion in the Hamptons she purchased nearly 30 years ago for under a million dollars, which is now modernized and worth about seven million dollars. The reality star definitely has some prime New York real estate, so you'll want to see what Ramona's homes have to offer. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Ramona Singer is best known for starring on the hit Bravo reality series, The Real Housewives of New York, and she's one of the original cast members. Ramona's also a serial entrepreneur, and while she recently developed her own anti-aging skincare products, Ageless by Ramona, she had businesses long before that. At an early age, she loved fashion, and after going to school, she started her first business when she was 30. Ramona launched her own company dealing with closeout merchandise and clothing, working with some of the largest retailers. These days, she's branched out with businesses in the jewelry and wine industries as well. Of course, Ramona doesn't do Real Housewives for free either, and given that she's been on this series since day one, we know she's raked in a lot of checks over the years. After multiple businesses and over 12 years of reality TV stardom, Ramona's estimated net worth is around $18 million or more. Hey everyone, I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, bringing you another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment. This one touring the New York homes of Real Housewives star Ramona Singer. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ring that bell for notifications because we post brand new videos daily. As always, you can follow me on Instagram to chat, and now let's get into this video. In 2019, it was reported that Ramona was closing a life chapter after selling her longtime home in the Upper East Side of New York City. The reality star had lived in her posh and beloved apartment for over 20 years and first listed it in 2018 for about $4.9 million. When she found a buyer about a year later, Ramona got a solid $4 million for the place. The upscale apartment boasted four beds and 3.5 baths within 2,468 square feet of space. As you likely guessed, Ramona's unit was in a luxury condominium building on the 16th floor with stunning views of the busy city. 2,500 square feet, open views, tons of sun, tons of closets, four bedrooms, three and a half baths. Ramona had said her apartment had open views, an open plan layout, tons of sunlight, and features like multiple closets and storage throughout. The abode was substantially renovated in 2017, and we can see that by how modern it looks. A spacious entry gallery opens up to the combination south and west facing living and dining room with beautiful hardwood floors and floor to ceiling windows. Talk about views. One major renovation carried out to the main living area was removing a wall in the kitchen, which Ramona oversaw, and this created an entirely open space here. The living room was decorated perfectly with a ton of grays, whites, and furnishings like a glass table, which was very chic. The kitchen is super modern with stainless appliances and a ton of counter space. Ramona loved to host brunches here in the past, and if there was no space at the bar and casual table in the kitchen, the dining room was big enough for a group. Her former master suite seems to be the highlight of the classy apartment, with a walk-in closet and spacious white marble bathroom featuring a soaking tub and separate glass steam shower. Her classy apartment also had three additional bedrooms, with a fourth set up as a cozy den. Other amenities that residents of the building had access to included a landscaped rooftop deck with more amazing views of Manhattan. Ramona had said she was looking to move on from the apartment because her daughter Avery was living her post-college life away from home. She explained, I'm an empty nester and I think it just makes sense to move to a smaller place. Traveling so much more and I still have my place in the Hamptons. So I think it makes good emotional sense for me. And while Ramona sold this place, she moved into another apartment in the Upper East Side with her dog Coco, which we're gonna take a look at next. 
After selling her longtime apartment, Ramona moved to a new building, which also had jaw-dropping views of Manhattan. She downsized slightly because it was just her and her dog. She showed off her new apartment and she brought the furnishings and style from her last place here, so it was very similar. It was open plan, located on the 31st floor of the building with plenty of floor to ceiling windows and natural light. Ramona had a large living and dining room, as well as a corner dedicated to an office space. Her master suite was still in the works, but it looked glamorous just as you'd expect from Ramona. The kitchen at this apartment was definitely smaller than the last place, but still had stainless appliances and was very functional. After Ramona showed fans her new apartment, she actually faced some backlash over the parquet flooring, which many believed looked cheap. I mean, can't you just focus on the amazing views of New York City and be happy? I guess not. Either way, the reality star ended up officially saying goodbye to those floors and moved once again, this time from the 31st floor up to an apartment on the 35th floor in the same building. The current apartment also boasts great views and this time no parquet floors. Ramona announced to her fans on her Instagram story, This is my new apartment everyone, plank floors. Look at this great view, no more parquet. Ramona said she loved the whole plank wood floor as well because it was more elegant and richer. I do agree that it does pull the place together better. Although she loved the views from the former apartment, she shared that the views were even better in the new one. She said, I'm very fortunate I have these great open views all the way to New Jersey. The kitchen in the new abode is also more modern and a major upgrade. The previous kitchen was kind of dark and uninspiring, whereas now Ramona has a big fridge which proves much better for entertaining. The spare room is used for when Ramona's daughter Avery comes to stay, while her master suite boasts a large window with perfect views of the city. She also has a plush bed, walk-in closet, and classy master bathroom. Let's not forget what might be Ramona's nicest property of all, her longtime mansion in the coveted Hamptons. Last year, the housewife star was spending a lot of time away from the city to retreat here, and I can see why. Located in Southampton, New York, Ramona and her ex-husband Mario Singer reportedly purchased the property way back in 1995 for only 857 k What a steal. These days, the home is estimated to be worth almost $7 million. Over the years, Ramona has also listed the mansion as a rental when she's away. A few years ago, it was up for $320,000 for the summer season, or you could rent it by the week for 55 k Anyways, the pond front estate is private and secluded, surrounded by mature trees and hedges, and inside spans about 7,000 square feet of space with six bedrooms and six baths. It's located in the Hamptons on nearly 1.5 acres of land, which explains the expensive price, as this is an exclusive vacation area which not many people can afford. The home is about 90 miles from Manhattan, and Ramona had made substantial renovations over the years. She upgraded the two-story home, and these days it fronts a grand exterior with paneled windows. On an episode of Real Housewives, cast members left the busy city in hopes of spending a relaxing few days at Ramona's Hamptons pad, and if you watch the show, you may recall the house. In usual Housewives fashion, the relaxing weekend still had some drama and tensions running high, but the ladies definitely enjoyed the luxury amenities at Ramona's home. Her castmate Luann was upset over her room assignment, and that was just one of the drama-filled moments. However, the mansion provided a gorgeous backdrop. The front doors of Ramona's mansion open into a large double-height entryway with curved, sweeping staircase, as well as a baby grand piano. Like much of the home, this space is decked out with minimalistic white, gray, and black accents, and the downstairs is open plan. The foyer opens up to a double-height great room, and there are plush white sofas, French doors to the yard, and of course, the large fireplace. Elsewhere, there's a more casual den with another fireplace and flat screen TV, and there's an eight person dining table perfect for when Ramona's friends are visiting. In a separate dining room, you'll find another 10 person dining table with floor to ceiling windows offering views outside. Her sleek white kitchen boasts state of the art appliances and marble island, which Ramona likes to decorate with cheerful yellow flowers. The space also has an ice maker for margaritas and of course a wine fridge because we know Ramona loves her Pinot Grigio. 
Ramona's master suite is massive, spanning 1,000 square feet of space with a perfect ensuite to match, boasting seven foot tall his and hers marble vanities and an eight foot shower with separate waterfall shower heads. The guest rooms are all unique, one with two twin beds and black and white photographs, as well as a room with green walls with plush upholstered bed where co-star Dorinda Medley stayed. A finished basement level boasts a games room with pool table and media lounge with massive TV. Ramona's mansion also has separate staff quarters with a private entrance, and this was where co-star Luann stayed and was famously displeased with being shafted to the lower level of the home. However, this room does have its own personal lounging area. Ramona's gorgeous Hamptons home has a landscaped yard with flowering gardens, lush greenery and terraces perfect to entertain with lounging and seating areas. There's also a large heated pool completing the property, and elsewhere a tennis court and bocce ball court. All right, so now we've taken a good look at the homes of Real Housewives of New York star Ramona Singer. Of course, she's a lover of the Big Apple and has always been living that city life. While she downsized her apartment after selling her longtime home in the Upper East Side, she still has those amazing views of the city and her new building is merely blocks away. After checking out Ramona's former $4 million apartment in Manhattan, her current apartment and her Hamptons getaway, which was your fave? I feel like that's an easy choice for me because I'm not much of a city or high rise girl, but I know those amazing city views from Ramona's condo will win many of you over. Either way, I choose that elegant Hamptons mansion. It had all the amenities you could need, not to mention a gorgeous swimming pool. Be sure to let me know your thoughts on Ramona's homes down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!